Hey everybody, it's BC here and welcome to another episode of Lumberjack's Dynasty. And as you can see, it's a fine, beautiful morning in whatever town we're living in. I have no idea, I'm sure I can look it up somewhere and find out. But I was uh, looking at the map here and apparently we don't actually own the mill. What we gotta do, as you can see, is uh, when I load up the game, it showed, the quest showed up in the top left there. But I actually have to pay off my uncle to get actually have the sawmill. So we're more or less working to keep it. But right now we're on our way to go see all of and uh, Oliver and his barn so I think we're gonna be fixing up his barn and maybe he'll show us some equipment I don't know and apparently there's a, a stranger we gotta talk to that uh, we'll deal with that later let's go see what Oliver's got to say uh, I have adjusted the, the game audio a little bit too I had uh, I turned it down a little bit because I don't know how it was gonna be so I turned the music up just a little bit and the voice a little more because I noticed that it was pretty quiet so since they hired voice actors to do the voice acting I might as well leave it to the professionals right all right so uh, does this road go down I don't know let's find it yes it does so we got to go up here and make a left all right yeah, so I'm uh, kind of curious to see how far this game actually goes. Like, I know uh, there's different things we can do. Can I get down here? Uh, maybe? I'm going to say no. There's roads for a reason. Uh, but anyways, we'll be there in a minute, so I'll see you there. And here we go. And it saves me some rambling, even though it wasn't that far ahead to go. But here we are. So let's see what Oliver has to say. Let's open up the gate and be courteous and close it behind us. Hello, good sir. This guy doesn't look like he belongs out here. He should be in the big city somewhere. Wearing a suit of all things. Free tractor and free logs, sure. Why not? So it says on his hat, I love LJ. So what I'm going to do is I realize the voices are still a little quiet. So I'm going to turn them up and I'll be right back. Okay, let's try that. So what does he want us to do? First of all, uh, I'm going to fix his barn. All right. I've seen worse. We'll find out in a second here. No, no, that's not how we fix his barn. Oh, this isn't bad. A couple of nails, a little bit of duct tape, and we're good to go. Yes, duct tape can fix anything. I'm a Canadian, don't you know? Anyway, uh, if you don't get that reference, uh, check out a show called Red Green. That's uh, a, a truly Canadian show. It's a great one, too. All right. And this doesn't take long. Gotta fix a few things, so uh, let me finish this up and I'll return. Okay, I'm almost done. I just got one in the back corner here I gotta do. Uh, where are you? There you are. I see you hiding up there. Alright. Uh, cut down. Alright, so we fixed the barn, so let's. Uh, I got nine trees and 29 bushes to cut down. Oh, over here. Alright. Now we get the right tool for the job. Does he have a small gate here? No, he doesn't. Okay, we'll just open that up. Well, we'll leave it open for now, because we'll be back. All right. So, uh, I'm guessing these nine? Does it actually show on the map? Yeah, something like that. I think this is in the area. Yeah, 
a little chainsaw mini game just fall fall the orange line. Watch this be the one tree that he wanted to keep. Oop, that was a little too far. And that was one of them. All right, I got some trees to cut down. And I will return. <laughs> it's still making noise. I hope it did hit the barn. Just fix that thing, okay. It's fine. <laughs> well, we're gonna find out if this is a thing or not. Good. I'll be back. Don't you love early access? Interesting. The bushes are a little different. You just walk into it, you don't even get a prompt. You just click with the mouse. Interesting. Apparently this is actually a bush, not a small tree. No, that was you. Go cut down somebody else's tree. No, we'll do that later. Anyway, I'll be back. And almost done. Oh, there's one, and... Uh, where is it? Where is it? Is it this one? Nope. Is it this one? Nope. Is it this one? Nope. I'm going to assume it's this one. Or is it? Definitely a lot clearer up here. <laughs> there it is. There we go. Haha. <laughs> go to Oliver, collect my reward. Well, my reward's right there. And the tractor. And uh, let's be nice and put the chainsaw away. I forgot left my hockey mask at, mask at home. I'm sure Oliver would love that. Yeah, I like that you bring up your engineer site and you can see who's around and uh, their overall disposition against you, towards you, and you can also oh, eavesdrop. Anyway. Trailer. Cut down trees, prepare new meadow. What? Isaac's over there. Eh, not a bad little tractor. Uh, let's see. Should we take it or should we take the truck? Uh, where is the truck? The truck's over here. Alright. Let's go pay Isaac a visit. And off we go. Gonna kinda suck though having multiple trailers to drive around. Wait a minute, isn't this my my uncle's farm? Or uh Bill? Going to the right one, are we not? No, 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 no. Uh, help Isaac. There we go. Oh, jeez. All the way over there. Okay, well, I guess I'll meet you when I get to Isaac. Okay, I was actually going to the wrong marker. I'm going to the right marker right now, but I was just checking it out here. These are actually all, like, claims that we can have access to, to cut for the trees to cut down. There's quite a few logs around. A lot of wood. But as you can see, we're getting close. Yeah, the one I selected was uh, uh, the stranger one. But anyways, we are here. There's a hotel with a small store near here. Maybe it's worth talking to the owner. I'll do that in good time. All right, here we are. Uh, and talk to the shopkeeper. Again, I'll do that later. I'm here about a trailer. Oh. Can anyone guess? Are we going to have to repair this place? I think so. Hello? Hi there. Hello. Can I help you? I was just passing by. I wondered if you need this log trailer. Do you want to buy it? I might sell if you pay well. As a matter of fact, no. But I can't work for it. What do you think? Have you got anything that needs to be done? What a coincidence. I really need that forest over there cut down. All trunks cut into logs, and these logs stored there behind the barn. Then I need the barn itself fixed. If you manage that, the trailer is all yours. 
Are you sure? There's nothing else you want me to do? Maybe fix up the house? Maybe paint the place? I'll do it. Sure. Free trailer. Just work, right? Okay, so I gotta cut down trees. A lot of trees, a lot of bushes. Bring out my trusty friend here. And I'll be back. Just about to cut down the last tree now, and yeah. It's an actual ski jump. Kind of weird that it's going right towards uh, this guy's shed here. I think it'd be going somewhere a little safer. But, yeah, it's just telling me to cut down the, the forest, it calls it. One man cannot cut down a forest. Maybe over some time you might be able to cut the trees down, but... There we go. Alright, store logs in designated, designated area. Okay, now how the, do I get them there? Let's bring up the engineer site. Let's get the branches off. Yeah, that's right. Different mechanic. I gotta actually hold it. Okay, and cut away the branches, and then we cut into logs. And I'm wondering if we can actually pick the logs up. Oh, that's the wrong button. I can. Ooh. Ah, it's no first person. All right, now how do I drop them? Uh, e works. No engineer vision. Engineer site not going to show me how to pick up the log. Come on. Glitchy. Come on, where are you? Oh, you're already technically in there. Anyway, I gotta store logs, I'll be back. Okay, I'm almost done. Uh, who would have thought that these carrying big, what, 200 pound logs would be strenuous and take a long time? Uh, I didn't. And look at those two, standing there watching me work. I'll get them. Eventually, what, wait, what did he say about me? Okay, I'm back with the last log. And no, they weren't talking about me. I was just trying to be funny. Alright, now to fix the barn. This should not take no time at all. I don't think I need scaffolding. What do you know I do? Unless... Well, that buzzard scared me. Don't know why. I don't think there's anything in this game to be scared of. I don't think the wildlife can even attack you. Uh, this looks like it's a quick repair. It shouldn't be too big of a problem. Uh, but it does uh, uh, sort of answer my question of how is it going to load the logs into the trailer if I don't have a crane. Uh, it turns out I don't actually need a crane for lifting the logs. It just makes it easier. So, yeah. A few more repairs. At least it's pretty simple to do. Just point and click, you know. Just like everything else in life. Told me that was the case. All right, uh, a few more here. Okay, do do do. Now I'm wondering about the like when you. Oh, I gotta go up on the roof. Damn you! Can I get you? No. So I'm gonna have to go up there. But I was wondering, uh, like if I go to let's say over at the mill there, if I go and start re rebuilding the buildings with proper planks, do I need a sink an individual plank for every plank on here, or is it going to be like five planks to fi fix half the section or something? I don't know. But anyways, I gotta go up on the roof and do some work, so I'll bring you back when that's all done. Oh, they really make you work for it, don't you? Uh, this guy's got a, a loft in his barn, and so I thought, oh, I could fix the roof up there, but apparently I can't. So I do have to put the scaffolding up and try to stand on that roof. But Anyway, uh, let me take care of that and I'll be back. And that should be it. The last one. Oh, you're going to be down here. Ta-da! Alright. Let's go collect a reward first. Pick up my scaffolding. Okay. And where are you? Not exactly. Hooray! I was going to say. Uh, not exactly farm apparel. But anyways, uh, where's this trailer? Cool. Oh, it does have a claw. Sweet. 
cool. So what are we doing now? Let's see. Who is that up there? Oh, that's a hotel. Uh, there's a lady by that gate going to say hi. Uh, wait, what? Old forklift. Ooh. Ooh, I could use a forklift. Let's go say hi, shall we? Uh, yes. Meet, uh, meet Sasha. Okay, how far is she? Not that far. I'll go run over there. I'll do a quick cut, and then I will return. All right, here we are. Now the question is, what kind of work do I gotta do for this forklift? I can't believe someone will actually give me something for free in this game. Good day, ma'am. How are you? Oh, hi there. And who might you be? I'm Charles's nephew, bringing his old lumber mill off the scratch. Great. How can I help you? That forklift over there. Is it yours? Are you selling? I have not yet thought of selling, but why not? What do you offer? I can't invest much money. Maybe I can lease it. Or I can work for it, too. Enough with that word. See this old forest just by the gate. I need this clean. Completely bushes too. And I need those logs stored too. I can offer the forklift if you do this for me. Interested? Sure. Gonna send me halfway halfway across the town. All right, so let's see what we have. Twelve trees and a hundred bushes. <sighs> Piece of cake. All right, let's go see what where we got it. Where we gotta bring these things. And I know I gotta go pick up the tractor and then go pick up the trailer and come back here and cut them up and load them up. And how many do you need? The trees are all cut down. Popular jacket. Oh, Alright, she's walking so it's not can't be that far. Can you walk a little faster, please? You just point on the map. Gee, your barn looks a little fi looks like it needs a little fixing. I have a feeling you're gonna be asking me that too, aren't you? Of course you are. Because I'm apparently the only person in town with a nail gun. A magic nail gun that can fix anything, even glass. <laughs> Let me guess here, right? Right where I'm standing. And you gotta walk to the furthest point. What'd you give me? Steroids? No, oh, grilled sausages. Lovely. Well, uh. How many do I need to bring? 26. Uh, sadly, it'd be fast for me to do it by hand, so I guess I'm gonna have to eat my sausages and take care of that. What is this? Magic beans. Oh, lovely. Might want to stay upwind for me. I'll be back. Okay, so I ran into a bit of a snag. I'm too tired. I'm at 60. I gotta go find a fire to sit by or take a nap or something. So I gotta go deal with that and I'll be back. Okay, I am done. This is the last log. Uh, needless to say, I could not find a way to sit in front of the fire. I'd have fire back at the house, but I could light the fire, but I couldn't actually sit in front of it. Alright, so let's go and claim our forklift. Sasha, you owe me something. I worked hard for it. Took me two days to do it. She looks so fake. Anyway, so we have a forklift now. Let's go check this bad boy out. And I think we're gonna call the episode here. Uh, let's say this whole area here. 
from cutting down to doing the logs. It took me 45 minutes to an hour. Aha! Alright, so, let's see here. Let's see how does this work. Well, that's pretty cool. No tilt or anything like that. I didn't actually know about that with the right mouse button on the camera. That's cool. Cool. How fast is this thing? Probably like a forklift, a dead slow. And of course you know what I'm going to try to do. It's kind of hard to drive two vehicles back. Maybe, maybe I can uh, pick up one with the other, right? Sure, why not? Be a pain in the ass to drive them both back because I'll have to walk here to get the forklift. Oop. Let's lower the forks. Get the weight in the middle. Oh, There's no co no collision on the truck. Hmm. Well, that's... It's a shame. But at least I'll be able to pick up logs. Yeah, I could have used this to carry the logs around over there. Uh, that's... Oh! Sasha's happy with me. That's cool. Uh, question I see is, I see fuel. I also see a propane tank. Does that mean we actually have to buy propane, or does it just use generic fuel like the truck and everything else? That is a good question, but uh, that is it. We are done. That is somebody over the gate there I think we're supposed to talk to. Who is that? Uh, top of the mountain. Talk to the shopkeeper. You might learn something useful. He seems to have an eye on things. Well, I'm sure he does, and we'll figure that out in the next episode. I think it's a good time to call it here. Uh, we have a forklift, or we have a forklift, we have a tractor, and we have a log trailer. And I also have to find a way to get them all back home. But anyways, I thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave me a like. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Later.